Welcome to another episode of JNC's Crazy Crossroads. I'm going to do a 30 minute alone challenge now. Chris is right outside on a live stream while I do this. Ah, this is kind of intense. This place, yeah, it's super creepy. And uh, we were here in the day, it was creepy. It's night now. Anyway, I'm about to do this. You're about to come with. Let's do this. All right, I'll show you. Chris is right there on the live, and then I'm going to come out and do mine, my live stream afterwards. This place is, yeah, very low ceiling. Look at that. a shoe last time that like was thrown or something when I was here and uh, yeah look at this creepy place all the cobwebs birds probably bats I don't want to see any I'm walking right into that Is anybody in here? That was the sneaker last time. Now the, the thing is I thought that was thrown last time and then I turned around and saw it like out of the corner of my eye move. But I wasn't sure until I played the video back and I walked past it and the sneaker wasn't there so that's creepy as hell. This room freaks me out the most. The fridge. I don't want the floor collapsing on me. I have some of Trying to be very quiet because last time, I mean, there is road noise, but there were things picked up in this house. in here. The thing that bugs me is that I think these were open last time. I don't remember, but maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. This is the front of the house. I hear what sounds like movement from over there. Can you shut the door?
Oh god, did that blanket look like there was a body under it for a second, like the shape of it? This is one of those things that Chris is timing this because, quite frankly, I'm not able to uh, see a timer on my camera for some reason. It's a small place. I thought this was cool. Can you talk? Can you make yourself known? So at one point tonight I was going to do the Necrophonic app, however, I get mixed reviews on that so I decided to refrain on this particular video. So here's the thing, like, you know, I, I, I don't have any special abilities by any means, but boy, does that room over there creep me the hell out. I mean, the whole house creeps me out, but that room, let's go back to it. It just feels like something dark and sinister in here. Can you do the door for me? <clears throat> Sounds kind of funny, but what really bothered me when I walked in here is this bedding. Like, I don't remember it from the last time being here, but something about it, like, it, I don't know, it's just it's freaky. I, why? I have no idea. <laughs> <clears throat> so whether these places are haunted or not, <laughs> coming into an abandoned house at night by yourself, even though Chris is outside, it's really powerfully scary. Talk to me, please. Sorry for, again, all the road noise.
So here's the deal. Something about this room just doesn't sit right with me. I'm really curious if we'll pick up anything in this room. Like I, my <laughs> like my spidey senses are saying, don't be in here, but that's exactly why I'm in here. Can you make yourself known somehow? Can you move the door? Please? That's a car outside. Guys, my heart is beating so heavy. Can you say something? Sometimes I play back these videos and I could hear something talking. I don't hear anything. I, I did hear something before when I was like over here. <laughs> See, so yeah, let's uh, kind of move around a bit. Okay, I stepped on something and that moved. <laughs> Definitely on high alert. Just talking, I think, now. Hello? I could be losing my mind, but it sounded like something was like whispering, and what it sounds like is like a little chatter. Are you talking in here? And again, guys, there's road noise. I think somebody passed in this room. I really do. It's got that. Ugh. And there's a pair of underwear right there. I, I don't even understand. Like, there's, there's Christmas stuff and underwear in so many places. But what I was saying was it's got that, like, weird, stale. Like, you could pick it up like something. Something either is here or is the presence of person who passed, it's just, and like I said, I don't have any special abilities, I'm not claiming to have any special abilities, and it just sounded like I heard some somebody say something. There's a car out there, but it sounded like right before the car's engine, it sounded like something. Then again, it's like so hard to tell, you know? Teddy Whitey's. Baseball glove. 
this I I just get the feeling this was an elderly person's home and they passed right in this very bed what the hell was that I thought Chris called me hey what's up did you call me Oh shit. <laughs> I heard like a voice in there, like I thought it was you. <sighs> okay. That was crazy now. I, I, did that come from outside the house? Inside the house? <laughs> I hope inside the house because that would be really cool. Whew. So that was crazy. I, I'm pretty sure that I heard a voice. I thought it was Chris calling me. Thing. I'm not playing cat and mouse with you. I, if you're here, you want to talk to me. Okay. That may have been Chris. I don't know. I just heard a voice. It could have been Chris. Foul odors in here. Oof. I'm going to try to concentrate on this room. All right, I'm here. And I just want to know, were you trying to talk to me? I heard something call me, I thought. I mean, aside from the creepy factor and I thought I heard something. It's pretty, pretty, pretty quiet. Which actually makes it a little creepier, to be honest with you. It's a bad odor now here. Really foul. Could be a dead animal in here. Shut the door like you did last time we were here. Can you do that? Hey guys, I don't know how long I've been in here. Like I said, Chris will let me know. Lots of cars. All right, let's see. I'm gonna shut the light for a minute. That must be nuts. Ooh, the red light. This place is friggin' this makes it horrific <laughs> for me. But I was told that through the red light you can pick up different things. Oh, it's so quiet now. Now's your chance to talk.
And I'm just going to shut the light right off. If there's anything here, talk to me. Okay, I heard that. That's when the light comes back on, folks. Something just went like... Mm -hmm. now, again, I'm not ruling out the possibility of road noise or an animal, but... It sounded like it was in here. Little whispers. I think. So I would ask you in the comments section if you do hear or see anything, you know, put it in the comments. Sounds like I'm hearing little whispers by that door. Not very comforting. I think of all the times in the past when we did alone challenges and were alone without somebody waiting outside. Not a good idea. I mean, honestly, anybody could walk in here. You do not want to be in here. I have somebody walk in because I'm assuming that they're, they're probably up to no good. All right, that's the, the other side of that door. There's nothing there. Just like a little hallway or closet. Or... all that stuff. Old toys. try this again I don't want to just walk around here in circles guys I'm sorry there's really no way around that that's what you do <laughs> and uh, this room has me way on edge whatever's here make yourself known please this is the last time I'll be in here Okay, there was a voice. Okay, do that again, please. That was great. Can you do that again?
That unfortunate that window is completely smashed out, so, and that's the front of the house, I think, where the, the road is, so. <laughs> There's a church right across the street. I don't know if you can see that back there, but right over there, you can see the cross on the front of the church. At least I can with my eyes. I don't know if the camera will see it. Can you talk again? All right, so <clears throat> So I definitely think I heard stuff. <laughs> um, it's always interesting when I put my earbuds on and play it back and you know see what may be in there. Um, peaceful night here now. There's not a lot of bangs, thumps, and things like that. Doors are not closing, which is cool in a way because it freaked me out, but I do want to see it, if that makes sense. Like, you want to see it, but you don't. Can you shut the door? Man, that would be so cool if that door shut right now. But, it's peaceful. Um, pretty sure I'm getting close to my 30 minutes. I kind of want this to be over because it does smell really bad in here. What was that? Dude, that was, that was actually really cool. Outside. Yeah. I almost fell through the deck coming in here just a second ago. Oh really? Yeah. Oh man. So. Dude, you gotta go in that. So the room with the waterbed uh -huh. definitely sounds like there's voices in there. Is that? Oh, this is the one. Is this the one where that the door? The door. The door didn't do was, anything tonight for me. Was, when we creaking. were here, the door did. Oh, yeah, but no. if you go by that waterbed and just be quiet, I heard. I know several. I know right. Like you keep hearing that. Is that? Maybe it's just me, I don't know, but you just heard that too, right? Yeah, alright. Ooh. Alright, so the camera, it, I've reached 30 minutes. Chris came in, the camera shuts off at 30 minutes. It just shut itself off, so I reached the maximum amount of time. So I'm going to go ahead and take over the live stream. Chris is going to film. Damn, I hit my head again. <laughs> Stupid ceiling. But anyway, guys, love, go in love and peace. Again, if you heard anything, let us know. I'm pretty sure I heard some stuff and it is creepy as hell. Alright guys, until next time, love and peace.